Hi, I'm Abby. Welcome to my channel, Abby's Big Ideas, where I share ideas to motivate and inspire you to think outside the box with your home decor. Today, we're gonna do some crafting, y'all. Recently, I redecorated my guest bathroom. If you haven't watched that video yet, it will be linked below. So, when I was shopping for accessories the other day, I saw these really cute soap dispensers that were made out of decorated mason jars. I really liked them, but on closer inspection, I decided they weren't worth the value because they were actually just stickers that were put on the outside of the jars. And I wasn't sure like how long they would last or anything like that. So I had an idea. I could just make these myself. I love decorating with mason jars and using them for all kinds of craft projects. So today I'm gonna show you how I'll use this mason jar to make a really cute soap dispenser for our newly decorated guest bathroom. I purchased all of the materials for this project for under $5. This box of 12 ball jars from Target costs $8.83, making each jar only 74 cents. Now that's a bargain. I got some pretty gift tissue. This is just tissue paper. Um, it was $1.99, but it came with eight sheets and I'm only gonna use one sheet, so that makes these worth about a quarter each. Mod Podge, y'all. I love this stuff. I use it for lots of crafting projects. This is a medium-sized container, but you can get a small container, which would be plenty for this project, at the Dollar Tree. The last item is actually the most expensive, and this was from Michaels. It's a pump for your mason jars. It costs $5.39, but of course, I had a 50% off coupon. Making my cost $2.69 for a grand total of just under $5. Let's get started. First, we'll want to cut our paper to fit the jar. So, when I measure this jar, it's about four and a quarter inches. I'm going to cut my paper at four and a half inches so that I can wrap it around this bottom edge. So we'll cut a strip four and a half inches. It's Mod Podge time. Let's pour some onto a paper plate. And I'm going to be using a foam brush. These are very cheap brushes. I can just throw it away when I'm done. And I'll use a paper plate to keep from making a big mess. Now, here's the fun part. Let's just coat the entire jar. paper onto the jar. And then we just want to smooth it down with your fingers. Once we have it all smoothed out, we need to let this dry for a little while. But Mod Podge dries quickly, so it won't take long. My jar is dry and finished, and I think it turned out really pretty. I love the extra color and floral design. This is gonna look really cute in our bathroom. Now let's put the pump on it so we can use this as the soap holder. We'll use the ring that came with the jar and the soap pump that I bought. 
This looks really pretty. I'm going to add a little twine just around here for some extra flair. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more fun and inspiring decorating ideas. See you next time. Bye.